the crap they know 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 the crap
her bark. All right, we're gonna keep going because what I'm gonna make a mold of, um, the fourth one I, I used it, it's gonna be some little trees, palm trees, and it's very little. Um, the palm trees, I'm gonna make it so that the palm trees can fit directly inside of a coaster, okay? So that's what I wanna do with those. Um, I'm gonna make a mold so that I can do different colors if I chose to and have it nice and neat, okay? But I wanna finish putting this together so that you would see um, everything, every piece. Let's put, make sure that's down. Oh, it's so snug, I love that. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Okay. And if you are a person that lose little binder clips, you can buy these binder clips from Alpha Amazon, Walmart, Family Dollar, Dollar Tree, anywhere you want to buy them. But I suggest that you try to keep up with these, you know, because these were meant for the Let's Risen um, pieces. So you want to make sure you keep them all. I'm going to take this right here and put it. Okay, friend. We got it. So it looks level all through here to me. And from the bottom, it does also too. Now see on the bottom, what you're going to do is take your double-sided tape. Let's peel that off. You take your double-sided tape and you're going to place it on this. Okay. I'm gonna place that there. All right, I'm going to go on the other side and put another one there. Okay. And then I'm going to take this off. Just like I said, it's double sided. And you want it to remain double sided like that too. Okay. So you'll be able to stick it down all right let's resin was thinking about everything they got everything in place for us so we don't have to think about all of that if i can just get this side loose okay almost why did i have to get so um stuck doing this I want you to see that it is easy to do. It really is. Put you a piece right here. Stick it down. I'm just gonna do it like that. This next side right here. Oh, you know what? I was I was not thinking about. Oh gracious! Once you stick it down, it's stuck. <laughs> oh my! Isn't that something? I was about to move it over a little bit. <laughs> Not that friend. <laughs> Not that friend. You won't you won't be moving that. Let's get this off some kind of way. Like 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 this. Okay, so I have that part off. Okay, and I'm just tucking the tape in like that. So now I'm getting this other side. All right. And I am so sorry I'm a bit slow at this, but this is my first time doing this. So um, I'm not going to say, you know, first timers, you know, you're going to have a hard time. No, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying I'm trying to make this uh, video just right for you. Let me pick up my little... Where's my little tool? Little tool here. 
I like to keep this little tool with me. This is a, a seam ripper because, you know, I used to sew and, in, in, you know, with embroidery and all of that kind of stuff. So a seam ripper is something that I always have handy. Okay. Another thing, another gift that I had got was this tape. And if I didn't say her name, her name is Miss Deborah. Okay, Deborah Kenya. All right, she's who who bought this stuff for me. Okay, this is resin tape by T S S Art. Residue free, heat UV resistant, chemical resistant. Hmm, two inches wide, four foot long. Look at there. So let's go ahead and get us a piece of this good tape. This good tape here, right here, honey. Friend, why you always got a problem? <laughs> Y'all, I cannot make a video without cutting up and laughing and stuff. Oh. Now, now let's risen. You know, they ain't gonna pay me no attention. <laughs> one day, y'all, one day, one day I have the correct uh, sponsors and stuff like that. They can still sponsor me. I'll, I'll behave. I will behave. Okay, so I'm going to take, I'm going to sit that right there for a moment. I'll take this right here and sit it down right there for a moment. All right. And these, is, these are the little trees, y'all. So they... They come from out of Dollar Tree last year, I think it was. And um, they're just the perfect size to go into a coaster. So that's what I wanted to do with them, all right? I wanted to be able to put them in a coaster. And I only have three. The fourth one I put in something else. But, you know, that's, that's no problem. It's, it is what it is. All right. So on your tape, okay, and I'm wiping this residue off really good. I'm going to stick the residue part on the tape, okay? So I'm going to stick it right there. And press down on it. And the other ones I already have it off, okay? So I'm going to keep these about three millimeters apart, all right? Um, and that's only because um, I'm gonna be using this. Uh, it's not anything to be sold to anyone or anything like that. This is just something I'm doing for myself and to so show you all, you know, walk you through each step with using a new product, which is from Let's Resin, all right? Let me cut the let me see how far how long I want to go. Oh gracious y'all. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute, let me cut this off a little bit more. <laughs> this is so not funny. Okay. I promise you it's not. So okay. Let me see. Can I oh, I got it, friend? <laughs> Got it, friend. So now what I'm going to do is take my tape and I'm going to sit it up here like this. And okay, let me show you on, on another part. Like it's still enough, it's still some room there that I need to put another piece of tape on so oh friend oh friend oh my <laughs> this is something okay I'm gonna put me another piece of double-sided tape there or better yet I'm gonna wait till I get my other strip I wonder can I split it in two I want to split I want to split this um because I, I need to you know I need to 
keep this tape, friends, for as long as I can. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to sit this right here, and I'm just going to go down the middle, if it'll let me. Just go down the middle. All right. And some people, they might not, you know, let's put this all the way. Oh, gracious. Put it right here. And the reason I did it like that, so that we can, oh, gracious. We can still have our double-sided piece down. Okay. This right here, oh, that's really close. Let me do this. Hmm, I went over a little bit more. <laughs> okay, on this one, we're gonna go there, just like that. Let's let that stick to the double-sided tape. And I'm gonna try to cut that off. All right, now I wanna see how much, um, I still, I believe I still need to put some more down. Um, I'm, I'm not, I'm gonna try it. This is, this is, this is what I do. I, I, I do love to try things. I do love to um, try very hard and see what's the grand ability for the product. All right, so we all know that on the end, gosh, there's enough room right there for something else. I don't have anything else to put there though. That not will that will give me enough space over on the other side. Hmm. Let's see. Anything small? Anything small? Oh boy. Just give me a moment. Just give me a moment. Oh, I don't want to have it raised up too high. Gracious. I was going to, you know, do that. Let's find something else. Oh, friend. Okay. Can I do this? If I put it there, nope, that, if I put it like this, nope, it's not flat enough. Just give me a moment, if you don't mind. I'm trying to find the best thing that I can put there. Um, will this, will this fit? No. Okay, I'm gonna have to go along with the flow, all right? Because I'm, I'm wasting too much time. So we we have this uh locked down. It's locked down, friend. All right. So we got that done. We need to get all of this, you know, pretty much out of the way. Because when, when we're working with uh silicone rubber, you don't want to use anything that will it's like um you don't want to use silicone to silicone. You understand? Um, you want to use silicone to wood or silicone to um, plastic, but not silicone to silicone. Say, for instance, um, I was using this. You don't want to use this, okay? You can use this to mix because that's plastic, all right? Or you can use um, a wooden stick, okay? I think we're going to go for the wooden stick. And I'm going to use about, should I use about two ounces? The try, try two ounces. You think that would work? Or three ounces? <laughs> honey, 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 honey. All right, let me see. Let me draw this back in a little bit so you all can see what I'm doing. All right, here, can you see that there? Can you see that? 
No, all the way there. You can see that. Okay, so do y'all remember when I made my, um, this coaster and I it tried to did another one just to make sure that it done right. Everything went right with it. And so I, I'm, the reason I'm showing you is because I said, oh, I like this color. This is a color that I'm going to stick to. So um, every time I do a mold of something, I'm, I'm sticking to this color, which is a mystic opal from um, Mayspring. Just wanted to show you that. I, I, I did things in purple, um, peach, pink, um, teal. <laughs> so I've, I've done a lot of different ones, but you know, I think I'm, that one is going to be my signature one, my signature color. Okay. This is part B. Just like resin, you have a part B and a part A. Why am why do I'm just having a time opening this stuff? Just gonna put me a slide right there. All right. So part B, I'm gonna go. Should I just do four ounces? Oh, that's what I'm gonna do. Four ounces is going to be a lot. I'm going to do three. Three, three, three. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's do three. Okay. And I, I'm doing three because I don't want to waste this silicone rubber. I don't. So that is 1.5 milliliters that I have in there. And so I'm going to go up 1.5 more for the uh, part A. Okay. And that going up 1.5 will give me my three total ounces. Because those those are very, very small. Okay. I'm not going to need a whole lot. All right. That's it right there. And we're going to. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and put my mica powder in there. So you see, here is my cup. Put this much mica powder. Okay. Close this, and I'm gonna go to work with stirring, stirring it up really quick. Okay. So, um, now. On these silicone uh, rubber kits, you don't, well, I, I say you don't want to really add any color into it or anything like that, but I've done it, you know, I've done it before over and over, and this this right here goes to show you that, you know, I've, I've done it, you know, so it's not going to do anything, at least mine hasn't, I, I successfully, everything I've done it has been successfully done each time. Each time that I added any um, mica powder to it, it's, it's been successful. And sometimes I like to add it just so I can see if everything's mixed up good. If it's white on white, how can you tell? <laughs> you know, how, how can you tell if it's mixed thoroughly? Well, honey, you can't really. Okay, and y'all see that I have my um the good side up because when we take it out the mold, and that'll be you'll be pouring into that good side. Okay, because the the top the the top side which is the bottom side right now, you're gonna be you're gonna cut that out, and you may not have to cut it out if it has a great seal on it. You may not even have to cut it out. And that's what I was trying to press, 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 press. <laughs> I'm not talking about Cardi B. <laughs> oh, let me stop it right now. Yes, I was trying to press, press, press it down. All right. I think we are good. Just 
break the sides, the bottom. Make sure everything is blended very well. Blended very well, okay? And now I'm gonna start pouring. I'm gonna start pouring. Okay. And oh my goodness, we didn't need all of this, friend. Let's see, I'm just gonna make it fill all the way up this this part anyway. All right. Well, I don't know. I don't know. I, I mean, it's... Okay. Now that filled up and I was left with one ounce. So actually, I should have just used those two ounces. I really should have. Um, since I, oh, I'm trying to find something that I can use this on. Hello, hello, hello. Try to find something. Something. I don't have anything close by. I don't have anything close by. So, um, just add a little bit more in here. And what we're going to do, we're going to let this um, sit. And when it when it's finished, then I'll bring you back. And we'll be able to use it. So I'll be right back. Okay, Crafty Creators, I'm back. So, <laughs> I did a few things, right? <laughs> um, So, you know, I said I had extra silicone rubber that was left. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't believe in throwing away nothing. I really, I really, I really, 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 really don't. So, I was like, well... Let me see what I can do with this and that and blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so, um, I decided to, um, see, can I make a little mold with the, the little wooden popsicle sticks? What do you know? <laughs> yeah. The little wooden popsicle sticks. <laughs> the only thing um I do have to you know clean clean the edge up, up here now because on this I just used a piece of tape and laid it down and you know I wasn't going for anything you know that would be like looking real good and stuff like that. I wasn't going for any of that. So on this my friends we're gonna see um did it did it work did it work did it work friend did it work all right so we're taking these off really fast look i got a bubble in my um my rubber my silicone rubber okay so Oh, wow. This is so freaking clean. <laughs> wow. Do y'all see this? Look how clean this thing is. I'm going to get back to you in a minute, baby. <laughs> but, oh, look. Y'all, do y'all I hope it's got the little wooden design in it, too. I don't think it does. It's just not shiny, but uh, it did great. Uh, uh, it did great. <laughs> I'm tickled. I am so tickled. I really am. Because I, I don't know. I just, you know, I've, I've done a mold before but I was just so you know I'm I'm tickled now this right here okay you see that <laughs> as my grandbaby say you see that you see that okay 
So now I do have some resin ready. Look, recycle. Put it over here so I can use it again. <laughs> you know? Oh, there was something else too. I wanted to see um would I be able to get the holographic from off of this paper? Okay. So I don't know what this is gonna turn out to be like. I just laid it down. Oh uh, nope, it didn't. It's not holographic. Now if that would have came out, I would have been like, what? But it's no holographic at all. Okay. I don't think it is. It don't look like it. So now I'm gonna I have resin ready. I'm gonna pour resin into these um and i do want it to i want to use the blanks as in you know having it clear that's what i would consider my blank okay so it's not going to take much resin for these um a matter of fact i think i got maybe um two oh gracious i'm wait i'm spilling i'm spilling i'm spilling <laughs> Oh man, just go ahead. I think I had two ounces in here. <laughs> Y'all heard me. Oh man, I'm spilling, I'm spilling. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. We 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 still, you know, we're doing it. Although this was not the official thing here, not this one, but these, yes, they were. So that right there is uneven and everything. And I can see that it's uneven. So I'm going to move right along to my palm trees. Okay. All right. I'm moving right along. And I need to do one because I want to have a set of four. I need to do one more um, by itself. So I know that I'm not going to have to use a whole lot of um, rubber, silicone rubber. Okay. This is like, wow, a nice experiment, huh? Don't y'all think so? I think so. Y'all y'all really gotta forgive me with my unsteadiness, really. I mean, ever ever since my surgery, I have been really unsteady with my hands. Oh, y'all saw how it jerked just now? I don't like that. I really don't. Okay, we're going to leave that. I have a mold over here that uh, I need to put some resin in. So maybe I should give it another couple of little drops in that one. Okay. A couple of little drops. A little drop here and there. I think that's enough. And... I don't think I can get this to come up, but <clears throat> friend, I'm going all over the place. <laughs> I can't, I cannot, I cannot do it. My hand is so not steady. I was going to get it to go off of it. Okay. Um, maybe it can still be of of some type of usage. I'll go ahead and pour this extra resin in this mold over here. Okay. That's one thing I do not do. I do not waste resin. And um, if you are a frequent 
frequent buyer of resin, you will not waste it either. So, um, like I said, I don't think this made it to the holographic that was from off of the paper because the paper still have the holographic on it. That's the back side. This is the front side. It is not up there. So that didn't work, friends. So don't don't waste your time on that part because y'all know I'll, I'll um, experiment in a heartbeat. Won't take me nothing but 2.5 seconds and I'm, I'm experimenting with something. I'm trying to go a little bit further. I'm trying to press the look a little more. I'm trying to see what things will do. I just, that's just what I do. I, I like it. I like it like that. Ain't that right, Cardi B? All right, I'm gonna throw uh, just a drop of heat. Well, I gotta use this other heat gun. I don't have that one plugged up right now. I don't really use this one very much at all. But just in case I have a little bit of bubbles in there, trying to make sure that it's all down in those spaces like it needs to be. Okay. I'll blow that off. All right. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. Uh, I have this part right here. I don't want to use that. It's a little bit too much right here. Okay. I didn't want it to, you know, be awkward. All right, so let me give you a close up. All right, close up. We'll be back to D mode, okay? Okay, we're back, Crafty Creators. <laughs> now we gotta see how this, this is done, okay? Oh, honey, let's see. Let's see, honey. Let's see. Oh, it's got the little, the little wood engravings and dentions on it. So that's nice. <laughs> yeah. I know, y'all. It's for me. It's the next morning, and my voice is not completely ready for y'all. But we did it. <laughs> Yes, it has some overage right there, but it's okay. I just wanted to have a blank, you know, to go by. It's got to finish curing as well, but this this is nice. I'm not going front. It's it's nice, okay. Excuse me. We let it do what it do, okay. <laughs> We let it do what it do. So now um, we know that this works just fine. And we can now um, use it and it won't be a problem. It will not be a problem, okay? Um, everything is good. Um, I like it. I like it. Um, it's it's nice and uh, thick. Okay, it's the back. All right. Let me come down some out of your face. The front. Really nice. It's done good. It, um, and now I I can have this for as long as it want to last, and have them to be able to go in the center of any of my coasters because um whether you know it or not um this is kind of like the south carolina tree palmetto tree um the only thing is missing is the little moon okay 
So it represents South Carolina. But um, this is great. This is really great. I, I'm proud of that. Really, really, really proud. Now, my for my little sticks, we all know they <laughs> it ran over and everything, but um, they did well too. Like none of this is is completely ready, but you know, and even this one, I'm gonna show you. It has the wood grain um, in this as well. You see how? Oh, yeah, you can see right there. You see the wood grain? So, yeah. I'd say that is some great um, stuff there. <laughs> some great rubber, rubber mold. The rubber mold is great. Uh, like I was saying on this one, it wasn't, you know, level. And so... Um, it just wasn't level, but I mean, it's not thick either. I only did it from a piece of tape, y'all. A piece of tape. Imagine that. Okay. So, yeah, we did it. We did it, friends. And what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to save this. I'm going to save it, let it finish curing. And... I'm going to use it. Okay. I'm going to use it. You know, we have our reusable. And I wasn't thinking about it. You know, this this one is one of the reusable ones. Um, real bendy. Real bendy and stuff like that. Um, it's nice. But it will be similar to the same thing. Okay. So... Um, if any of y'all are interested that uh, this piece, these pieces are from Let's Resin, okay? And I wonder, can I just leave this like this, you know, just in case I wanted to have something else around about the same size and use it, you know what I mean? I think I could. I can reuse that. I don't want to. I don't want to just pull that apart just yet. Although I took the binder pieces off, I don't want to pull this off just yet because I can use that again. <laughs> I can use that again. See if I wanted to just go ahead and make um, this stick right here. I could use it again. But what I might do, I might take a. Uh, like a couple of these um glue them together stack them on top of each other so it can be a little bit more sturdier or i may just do one of these you know who knows okay but i'm so glad you all was here with me on this experiment this was a great experiment um oh let me show you this don't worry about your wood okay do not worry about your wood because your wood is still good. All right. Still good. So what I plan to do is keep this all together. My silicone making kit with my tray. And I'll put all of my um, my binder clips. I'll put them back in here. Okay. I know you can't see me right now. I'm going to get back on camera. <laughs> Put my tape here. So I've, I've got a get ready box. It's already ready. <laughs> get ready tray. How about that? I'll turn this upside down like this. Um, wait a minute. We're going to do that. <laughs> We're going to do that and just have it there. Okay. Um, it will be a, a deal setter if this was Let's Resin. It'll be a whole kit <laughs> together. All right. But it's not. But I am thankful for this birthday gift. Um, and I, my birthday is on the 27th. So hopefully we'll be made a few more items 
for my birthday okay um so that's all i'm gonna leave you all with um oh the extra i don't think you was with me when i was doing this i had some extra uh resin uh earlier doing something let's take this off okay it's a little bluish tint to it okay I was using it earlier and I mean yesterday and I was like oh I'm not wasting no no resin and so that's what happened part of it this top this top part here was white and then the bottom part was like blue so it, it reflects this blue um tint looking thing here this this was my my clear one this is the blue one see okay so I'm going to leave y'all now um, with that. I hope you enjoyed it from the beginning to the very end of the mold making process. Uh, I have another video that, you know, I've made making a mold, you know, but I haven't. I didn't go all the way through. I don't think I, I don't know whether I went through the part of um, actually making it and everything. I think it was all a separate video. So if you want um this will be the idea one to follow through on you know especially if you're going to get the let's resin um shapers to make your mold okay um if you're going to use those this will be a great start video um to how to put it together um just in case you don't know and on using the uh, the rubber mix okay uh, and I know yesterday I said uh, this was like a 40 minute wait uh, work time. Y'all, I don't know why I said that. Um, I think I was referring to resin, but it did not take, I don't even think it took two hours for this thing to get right, get set. And, you know, I was able to, I, I tapped it. I was like, oh, I said, okay, we ready. <laughs> we ready, you know. So um, just keep that in mind. It's not going to take long for you to um, use it, to do it. All right. And like I said, um, I'm making this my signature color for my molds, which is May Spring Mystic Opal Mica Powder. It looks good. This is, um, see how wonderful that looks. Looks really nice. Um, and I like using, I like using the, um, this mica powder. I really do. All right. This was a pearlescent pigment powder. Um, they're nice. It's from the gem collection of May Spring. They have the two-tone collection, the uh, gem collection, and the geode collection. Those are the, the three that they have out now. So you can wrap them. I have a coupon it listed in the description um i don't have a coupon for let's resin but um i'll probably be trying to you know get them to sponsor me on um some mold making ideas or something you know at least i can pitch it to them and see what they say um if not i'll still continue to make everything and the little trees these little trees this you know it come from the dollar tree okay the dollar tree last year or year before that one of them i i can't remember but they had the little flip-flops and the little pineapples you know the pineapples i could have did those because those was four and you know that's similar to um you could put that into a coaster and that will look good too well, I might do those as well. And the flippers. I mean, all of them is, is worth a shot. You know? So I'm going to put these back in the bag. Okay. And I want to say, I want to let y'all know to be kind. Say something nice to someone. 
always think positive no matter what you do and um i'll see you on the next one bye for now